Welcome everyone to another Clash of Clans video on the channel. That's right guys, thank you all for tuning in. It's Clash and Mike coming at you guys again. I'm trying a new mic setup guys, not a new microphone, but I'm trying a different distance, a little bit different microphone setting, so hopefully the audio sounds good. Hopefully it's better than what it has been because I feel it's been a little bit echoey recently. I hope to resolve that with this, what I'm currently doing. Before I jump into today's video, I wanted to quickly say a huge thank you to a certain individual. I received two comments from this individual on my most recent video, the biggest loot raid in Clash of Clans. Guys, I really wanted to give a huge shout out to Reek because they gave me the support and the drive needed to continue doing what I'm doing. I feel that I've been losing the drive to really continue doing Clash of Clans and YouTube videos recently and they gave me the drive to continue doing it. You left such a heartfelt message on that video and whereas I was really struggling to feel the need or the desire to keep putting out videos daily and putting in all the effort that's required to of course record, edit, audio, video, you know, uploading and everything, I feel like I've been losing the drive to do that recently and I wanted to give a huge thank you to you because you gave me the drive, you gave me the support that I feel I needed to actually continue feeling that I should do this. You know, I'm going to continue pushing, I'm going to continue driving myself to do better and striving for better content. So before I jump into today's video guys, just a huge thank you to Reek for those comments, you really did give me what I needed for me to continue doing YouTube and to continue trying to be a better YouTuber and better individual. So thank you so much. But guys, now we can hop into today's video and I wanted to first start off by saying the town hall guys, it's going to be done in less than two days. That is very, very exciting. So immediately once it's done, we're going to start pumping out those next upgrades for town hall level 12. This is gonna be so exciting guys, I can't wait. Town Town Hall 12 is a huge upgrade from Town Hall 11 because of course we get a defensive Town Hall which is going to have the Tesla on top. This is going to be so amazing but guys we do also have two free builders at the moment and this is very very exciting. We really need to start working on some finishing upgrades for Town Hall 11. We need to of course work on the Archer Tower. Guys that is going to take I believe a day, yep a day and a half to completely upgrade so that's exactly what we're going to do guys. We're going to start that upgrade immediately a day and a half and that's going to be done around the same time as our next town hall level but we also have the cannon down here we need to of course work on getting our barbarian king to level 50 he's only a level 46 at the moment we of course need more dark elixir so we're going to go and attack today in today's video i also wanted to touch on something else I have not been making any content of my builder base guys and I do apologize but I feel like more people really do enjoy seeing the regular base, the regular town hall, not the builder base and builder hall. I'm going to continue doing this and if you guys want to see some content on my builder base leave a comment let me know you want to see that but for now guys let's hop right into a match so we can hopefully get some loot and maybe work on upgrading some walls because we don't have enough to work on our Barbarian King. I'll see you guys when I'm in a match. So of course, I also wanted to mention, because I did just find a base, I am farming. I'm trying to get as many resources as possible to continue upgrades. I'm not trophy pushing, I am purely working on farming and getting all these upgrades done. So guys, let's just go straight into this attack. We're just gonna pop everything down because we don't really care about getting the 50%. I truly only care about getting all of this loot. That's what I need. And if I don't need to use these miners, I don't think I'm going to. Alrighty guys, so there we go. We just got basically all the loot, but we're going to let our troops get the 50%. There we go, guys. We got the 50%. I do see this Dark Elixir drill right up here. I'm going to put down my Archer Queen so that we can get it because, of course, we need all the Dark Elixir we can get, guys. I'm going to then make her invisible to save her. And the match, we got almost 3,000 Dark Elixir. I'm also going for regular Elixir and regular Gold because that is also going to help us. Let's go see what we can do here. We need to quickly make a few more troops. There we go. We're just going to finish training them completely so that we can do another attack, guys. We're then going to train a few more troops, train as many of these miners as possible, and I'll see you guys when I'm in my next match. Alrighty guys, another great loot base. This is going to also be one that hopefully I can get a majority of the loot. First of all, I wanted to point out, because I am noticing 
a lot of players do actually put a couple of their drills, for example, the Dark Elixir drill and their collectors are inside some of the walls, and that is a very, very smart thing to do, I will say. It's pretty smart if you're gonna go about it that way because of course you are going to be saving some of that if you are AFK for a long period of time. Guys, we're just going right for it. Putting down a couple of our miners around the base just to pretty much take as much loot as we can pretty easily, hopefully. We're then going to put down a party wizard right here. Hopefully finish off, there we go, guys. Alrighty, let's see what we can do to hopefully get inside this base and get a little bit more of that loot. So I really, really want to try and go for this top area right here. So that's exactly what we're going to do, guys. We're going to just take out, hopefully, this army camp right here. We're then going to try and take out this builder hall. And from there, we're probably going to put down one P.E.K.K.A. at the bottom and one P.E.K.K.A. at the top. Follow it up by all of our wizards. Alrighty, guys. One right there. One down here. A couple of wizards around just to hopefully help him. And we're then going to put down two of our miners. They're going to completely take out that elixir collector while the P.E.K.K.A. is doing a little bit of distracting. There we go. Almost finished off, but it's okay. Almost finished it off. Guys, I think I'm also going to put down the archer queen right here. She's going to hopefully... Oh, never mind. The P.E.K.K.A. is going to get in there. Hopefully, he'll be able to take out that dark elixir drill. There we go, guys. Dark elixir drill is no more. Let's see about this side over here. Bada bing, bada boom. Can she do it? Alrighty, come on, come on, Queen. You gotta go for that Dark Elixir drill. No, you're facing the wrong way, Queen. There we go, guys. There we go. Taking it out. Getting as much of that loot as possible. 4,500 Dark Elixir. 1.2 million loot right there. That is pretty good. Not gonna lie. But let's hop right over to our base again. See what we can get done while we're here. So what upgrades do we have going? Right now, we have the laboratory working on an upgrade. We're not really going to need any elixir. Actually, you know what, guys? We definitely want to work on the free spell. So that is what we're going to work on upgrading next. That's going to be a 6 million elixir upgrade. So we don't want to use any of our elixir for a wall. But what I am going to do is I am going to use my gold for a wall. So just one wall segment. 2 million gold, there we go guys, one wall segment completely upgraded to the max level 12 for Town Hall level 11. Guys, the next video will hopefully feature a lot more content with some more upgrades, and we're just gonna have to leave the video there because we still have two days until the Town Hall is completely done. As always, thank you all so much for tuning in to another video, I love you guys so much. Thank you for the support on my recent videos. So as always, I hope you guys have a good one, later, peace.